Hey guys, James from the Research Revolution. Check this out. Survey shows voters getting stressed out by the election in 2016. That's for sure. New evidence shows that campaign 2016 is having an emotional impact on people, stressing many out, and in some cases, even ruining relationships. The fighting and acrimonious campaigning between Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump has gone on for months over television airwaves and across the internet. This election is one of the nastiest ones I've seen, says voter Randa Piona. It's like two high school kids fighting back and forth, passing bad notes, agreed voter Anton Bradford. Studies are indicating that all election drama is starting to take a toll on the voting public. According to new survey from the American Psychological Association, nearly half of Americans say the 2016 presidential election is stressing them out. It has become emotional and it has become polarizing, Dr. Douglas Halderman of the American Psychological Association says. Dr. Halderman says the stress comes down to how we are processing the information. Because of the emotional tone of this campaign, we bypass the part of our brain that does the rational logical thinking and has gone straight to the emotions, explained Dr. Halderman. And the campaign is triggering emotions for just about every group. According to the survey, the election the election stress cuts across demographics and party lines. The anxiety is so bad for some that they are turning off their computers and phones and turning away from social media. I just really don't use it as much. It just really it's just really inflammatory, said Walnut Creek voter K Kensington. There's definitely a lot of people who are saying things like this. If you don't agree with my political beliefs or you don't have the same political views than I do, I'm going to have to unfriend you. And I think that's because the candidates are extreme, said voter Lauren Endenberg. But Dr. Haldeman says that you may not want to burn bridges, though you should try limiting your exposure to election coverage. The American Psychological Association recommends voters try to avoid conversations that could turn them into confrontations, controlling their actions and keep your eye on the big picture. Remember, whatever the outcome, this country mm -hmm. will survive. Remember, whatever the outcome, this country will survive, said Dr. Halderman. His message, keep calm and remember the bitter end of the election is only three weeks away. A little picture here. Little Joker face, Hillary Clinton. Alright guys, later.